Let's get back into the swing of it. Alright. Last time I finished episode 3 and we found out that Clem has been talking to someone very, very strange. Huh. It's a great alternative history. Right there. Anyway, Clem has been talking to someone we don't know. This is trouble. We can't allow this. So we're going to not go by the plan. Because who do you trust really that says, Oh, got your parents right here. Previously on The Walking Dead. Mm. Shut up, Carly. Ugh, I've heard enough out of you. Now, what the fuck's the problem? <laughs> Just kidding. God damn it, Carly. Fear out what to do with you. I was trying to protect all of us. Holy shit. She's stealing the RV. Yeah, she stole the RV like a little bitch. Folks. I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. Y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. Oh, and I got to shot Ducky. Yay! I think we should look for your parents. Really? Yeah. You need to know if they're okay, and, well, if they're not, what happened to them? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. We gotta jump! What? God no way! Good, damn it. Ben. Ah! Yeah, it's saved on me. And there's a creeper. The right there. Right here. And uh. be sure to find me whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I need. Who the fuck? I don't know. But I doubt we're gonna be happy when we find out. My plans are definitely changing. I am not finding Clem's parents because of it. That. Hmm. Alright. Let's go, episode four. Ah, the walking dead. Yes. Alright, okay, so we've gone off the train. Excellent. We're sure that that horde is going to come and reach us eventually. Because Jesus Christ, it was large. Hmm. Ah! Kenny, Ben, Chuck. Uh. Crippled will be Clementine and Chris uh, Lee. Is it Chris or Chris Stop? My dish Chris Stop. Clem, come on. Can't I just hold it? Sorry, Clem, I'm not allowed to let you hold it. It's just not good for you. Not now, but maybe like a Just okay. for a little while. We're getting real close to where my mom and dad are. Maybe I can. Not now, Clementine. Maybe later, okay? Yes. Okay. Just say maybe later. Maybe she'll be fine with it. His leg's pretty bad. I'm fine. You're not fine. You need to rest. He needs to rest. Yes. Kenny, how much farther to the river? Just ask him how far. There should be just a few more blocks up ahead. And there'll be boats there. There sure as hell better be. There'll be boats. Have to be. Have to be. It's going to be okay. And he knows what he's doing. Mm. I'm not sure about what that right hell? now. Maybe this city's not so dead after all. No, it's Keep definitely moving. dead. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. On a timer. Yeah, but the undead are still coming. What kind of church bell goes off at 20 past the hour? Oh, I Someone's someone. up there. Are you sure? I don't see anything. I know what I saw. I'm telling you, there's someone up in that bell tower. Someone alive. Yes, get paradise. If I were you, I'd get out of the street now. I thought you said that thing didn't work. Who are you, goddamn? Who the hell is this? Hello. 
Hello! I said answer me! Uh, God damn. I'm so angry, though, that he was talking to Clem, poisoning her mind. What the hell was that? Is someone trying to fuck with us? Sounded more like a warning. Ask not for whom the bell tolls. What are you yammering on about? It yes, tolls just... for thee. Anyone would know that would, that was going to happen. The zombies are attracting noise, guys. How do you not realize this, man? Everybody, run! Ah, some bastards behind us. Come on, fine. Go, 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 go. No, Kenny! Help, Kenny! Kenny! Kenny, help! A little too close, don't you think? Ben! Oh, come on! No, Ben, help her! Ben! 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 God ben! You goddamn son of a bitch! No! Oh! Oh, thank you, Chuck! You save you! Get the hell out of here! I'll catch up with you! Chuck! You better survive this, Chuck. Move your asses! River Street's right up ahead! That's not all. I'll give me a fucking break! Wait, where the hell's Chuck? <laughs> Shit, he's in trouble. We gotta help him. Yeah, there's no time. We gotta go, now! I'll be fine! Just go! Go, go into the house! <laughs> oh, me galloping! It's weird. Anyway. I'll get the door. You okay? Uh, yeah. You've opened up your wound. You're bleeding. Shit, it's gonna get infected. We've got to get him inside. Clean him up. All right. Kenny, how's Go that clean. door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster, would you? Won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. I'll find it. You know in. they can smell blood. Let me see if I can find us a way in. All right, okay. They can smell blood. That's fine. Okay. Let's talk to Clan. Make sure she's okay. Go make sure she's mentally well. Do you think the dead people saw us come back here? Are they going to find us? I don't think they did. No, they didn't see us. We were too fast for them. I can still hear them out there. It sounds like they're getting closer. It's just your imagination. I'll feel safer when we're inside the house. Yes, Clan, we'll, we'll, we'll be fine. Alright, okay. How's he looking? I'm alright. You're not alright. You've reopened your wound, you're losing blood. And God only knows what might have gotten in there. It could be infected. It could be... No offense, but you really need to work on your bedside manner. <laughs> oh, well. Uh... Try not to worry. It always looks worse than it really is. Except when it's a bite. Yeah. yeah well, it's not a bite. We're gonna get you fixed up. Just get us inside the house, will you? I'm on it. Lee? Yeah? Thanks. No problem. <laughs> yeah, reassured them. Hell yeah! How you guys doing? Not great, so long as we're stuck out here. Will you please go figure out a way to get us inside? All right, Clem, are you okay? Are you Can okay, Clem? Will be inside soon? Yeah, not much longer now. Okay, so we can't so. tell. It's getting cold out here. No, no, Clem, we can't let you get cold. Oh. Looks like something was buried here. And there's a doghouse right next to it. It's a dead dog. Just a doghouse. Alright, it's a dead dog, isn't it? Alright, okay. Not thirsty enough to drink that yet. I don't know. 
Maybe me. Alright, let's get a shovel. Yeah! It's never not useful. We can use a shovel! We can become Chuck the second! Alright, okay. Let's talk to Ben. He f Ben. About Clementine. About what happened back there on the street. I know. I don't know what happened. I just froze up. Hasn't that ever happened to you? Just hear what I'm saying to you. Yeah. You put that girl in danger again. It won't be walkers you have to worry about. Oh! I hear you. I about Kenny? How do you think Kenny's holding up? Yeah. I don't know. It's it's like all he can think about is finding a boat. He definitely doesn't want to talk about Katja and Duck. At least not with me. Maybe we should just let him deal with it in his own way. Rest in peace, Kenny. Think we can get in through uh, one of these windows? Man, I don't think so. Whoever owned this place had them all barred up. Yeah, looks pretty solid. I'm gonna go check things out. All right. Don't they just sound so jovial about it? Damn. Damn! No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. Nor do you really want to. No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. <laughs> Alright, Ken. Let's talk, Ken. How's it, Dark Eye? How's it coming? Find a way in. Come on, Ken. Door's locked up tight. Too heavy to force it without making a whole lot of noise. Maybe there's a better way in. Well, if there is, I ain't seeing it. You think maybe someone's still inside? Nah. We'd have heard from him by now all the racket we're making. But whoever was here did a pretty good job fortifying it. Nice place to hole up. We can just figure out how to get in. Hey, how you holding up, man? Lee, hmm. I appreciate the interest. But I don't think talking about my feelings right now is going to help us get inside this house. Maybe you should have a look around. See what you can find. Alright, okay, well, let's have a look at... No way I'm going to be able to bust through that. Oh, yeah, of course we can't. No way we're going to force that open. Not without making a lot of noise, at least. Alright then, Lee. Ooh, doghouse. What's this? Not doghouse. Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. Pet door. Pet door. What? I tried it already. That's locked, too. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I have. My neighbor had one just like that. It's, it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Yeah. Well, shit. Every day's a school day. <laughs> All right, okay, so... Fair. Where's the dog? It's in the grave. You can quite clearly infer it's in the grave. Alright. Come on. Diggy, 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 diggy. Dig, dig, hey, dig. Be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be, you know what I mean? Yeah, I hear you. I don't want to climb to see this. I don't want to climb to see this. What's buried down there? Nothing. Clem, go over and sit with Krista and Omi, okay? okay? But I want to... Just do what I say, okay? Oh, sorry, Clem, but I'm sparing your feelings. Sparing your feelings. You don't oh, want to see a God, dead dog. Smell. Must have belonged to someone. No shit, it has a collar. <clears throat> Can't get it off. Ugh. Okay, that is not cool. Oh, no. I'm fine, honey. It's just the smell. Are you sure you're... I said I'm fine, okay? Oh, she's pregnant. She's pregnant. She is absolutely pregnant. Let's have a look. Inspected do headless dog. Ugh. Ooh. Stinks like hell. Maybe it's a hellhound, Lee. I don't need that anymore. I'm done digging up dead dogs for today. No, but you can... You can bury the dead dog so that Clem doesn't... Let's see. Are you okay, Clem? Will be inside soon? Yeah. Not much longer now. I hope so. It's getting cold out here. Uh, sorry, Clem, for upsetting you, but I don't want you to see that. That was... That would have been horrible. Alright, anyway, unlock the door! Open Sesame! 
Yes! God damn! All right, and now Clem is probably the one that goes inside. You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Oh. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. Be careful, man. Yep, no, I can't reach up there. It's no good. I can't get it. Here, let me try. I think I can. <laughs> oh God, Clem. Clem, are you okay? Say something. Oh God, damn it, Clem. Clem, so dangerous. Ta-da! Aw. Good job, Good Clem. job, Clem. Yeah, Aww. way to go. I did good, right? Yes, you did. Yeah, don't do it without telling me, though. Can we maybe have this conversation don't. inside? My leg's starting to hurt like hell. Yeesh. Looks okay from here. Everybody in. Ah. All right, okay. We're indoors. Huzzah! Well, this place is fucking creepy. Whoa, uh, the shit, that portrait. Sorry, sorry. No, it's okay. I'm good. I feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, babe. <laughs> oh, a creepy portrait. Absolutely creepy portrait. The worst. So, when were you going to tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing uh, with the rest of us? I was gonna tell you, Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. What? But who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you yep. think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? How Don't much sense does sense. anything make anymore? There's in case stalkers. you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least the dead don't play games with you. Yeah, there's stalkers. Seems like they're following us. I don't like being followed. All the more reason to get on a damn boat where we can't be followed. I'm not going back out there anytime soon. Omid needs to rest. Yeah. Yeah, he definitely does. We, we need to make Chuck. sure Chuck is okay. Once it's quieted down outside, we'll all head towards the river. See if we can find him. Deal? Suit yourselves, but I'm not going to wait around too long for someone else to grab up those boats. That's our ticket out of here. Yeah, okay, Ken. I don't know why you're so focused on the boats, though, since your family is dead. Place seems secure, at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. Absolutely, I agree. All right, fine. I agree. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door, understand? Okay. All right, Clem. What Can up, girl? What if there's another locked door? I think you've been helpful enough for one day, kiddo. Why don't you just see if Kristen Omid need anything, okay? Aww. Okay. She doesn't she doesn't feel good. Oh, poor dear. Let's go to the backyard. Or nah, let's stop. All empty. Oh shit. Wait up. Gotta replace my batteries. It's starting to beep de boop de bot all over the place. All right, booty bot all over the place. All right, okay, there we go. Got my batteries in. All right, let's explore the sink. Is there water? Nothing. Water's off. Well, I mean, I'm not surprised. All right, okay. There's a microwave. Microwave. No power. What was what 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 was I thinking? Yeah, so let's turn on the microwave. We clearly have power. Oh. Poor Walter. Oh, Walter. Oh. 
for dog. All maybe. cleaned out. Hmm. Anyway, let's look at dog food and maybe eat some. Yeah, we're gonna eat dog dog food. Hope we never get desperate enough for food that this starts looking appetizing. It looks appetizing, Lee. We're eating. I'm not that hungry. Besides, I need to finish checking the downstairs. What? Come on, Lee. We have to eat the dog food so everyone else can eat the normal food. Must have stopped working a while ago. Yeah, because it's a fucking wrong time. Shall I use us? Whoever cleared this place out left behind two bottles of whiskey. Looks like someone didn't have their priorities straight. How's it coming? I'm gonna take the bottle of whiskey! Probably not the best idea right now. I need to stay frosty. Well, I'm gonna give it to Omid! He needs the whiskey! Looks expensive and heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. I mean, they wouldn't. They'd need a big truck, most likely. Alright, okay. Let's talk hey to Chris Omid. Let's see. How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet. But so far, so good. Yep. How about the boat plan? What do you guys think about this plan at Kinney's? The guy's losing it. Look, Lee, I know he's your friend and all, but you need to be careful. That man is on the edge, and I don't know if I want to be around when he goes over it. No, he'd be Kinney's fine. Son. It's just been through a lot, that's all. I hope you're right. For all our sakes. Yeah, he's, of course he's all right. Anyway, your leg feeling How's better? How's that couch treating you, Omi? Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. Feel you. Uh. <laughs> oh my god, that face. Anyway, finding this house was a hell of a stroke of luck. Ooh. I like it a lot better when we know for sure it's safe. I'll make sure. But right now it feels like just the break we needed. Maybe our luck's starting to turn around. I yes. I believe that. Really Maybe. Would. Maybe our luck's starting Sit to turn. Tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Yeah, it's not like Thanks it's gonna. Be this has a disaster zone or anything. The old secure. Hold it up, okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? No, I have not. I'll take care of it. Alright, Clem. Um, let's first take the alcohol. Probably not the best idea right now. I want to give it to Omid! Frosty. Omid needs that! He needs it bad! Look at him. He's gonna die if we don't clean his wounds. Clean Azeroth's wounds! I should finish checking the house before heading back outside. Oh, come on, Lee. I'm sure the house is fine. It's perfectly fine. I'm not gonna go upstairs yet. Actually. Alright, there's a zombie oh, here! <gasps> what? What happened? I got scared by it's a mop. Just uh, nothing. The mop! The mop will kill me! It killed me, Clem! Can I actually go upstairs? Kenny and Ben have the second floor covered. I should finish checking down here. Alright, okay, making sure, just in case I could, you know, talk to them at some point. Would be Grand to be a grand old plan. Let's look at the paintings. Look, look at the creepy paintings. Everyone loves the creepy paintings. <laughs> Not exactly my style. I don't think anyone's style, Lee. Oh. Anyway, creepy. It's just a creepy picture. If I get older and have a family portrait like that, I am... Honestly... I don't feel like it... I feel good about that. Nothing hiding in here. Except a dingy old toilet, Jesus Christ! Just one more to check. Disgusting! Alright, open the door. Open sesame! Oh no, look, there's a miserable zombie hanging from That's the, the last room. Looks like downstairs is secure. Well, place ain't got much. 
We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. No problem, Chris. Is he okay? Krista. Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Nah, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. Go, Go ahead, Clem. Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. You're not in trouble, but I am very disappointed it's in you. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. No. Clementine, honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Oh, no. Oh, no, something's Lee, happening. you need to get up here now. What's wrong? It's Kenny. Kenny, he's gone berserk. Oh, no, wait. Never mind, he's fine. He's just in a... Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? I can't get him to come down. Oh no. Kenny! Kenny! Calm down! Oh no. Kenny, Kenny, where are you? I'm coming to get ya! Coming to get ya! Oh! Oop! Kenny? Oh! Kenny really sucks at hide and seek. Oh wait, there's something moving. Oh dear. What has Kenny found? Kenny, you okay, man? Come on, Kenny. Kenny, come talk to us. Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? Oh, my God. Oh. And... Yep, zombie kid. It looks like Duck. Looks like Duck before I shot him. Oh. Ah, uh, well. Duck, don't he? Yeah, he does, actually. He's just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here. Starved to death. Jesus Christ. Rest in peace, child. I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. Kenny, you can do this. Before you... it was your own son. Now it's just a kid who needs your help. You can do this, Kenny. You need to do this. Yeah, you definitely need I to know. do it. I I just... Oh, God. Alright, okay. Let's look at a zombie. Actually... Let's look at a zombie. Poor kid. Must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. This could have been Clementine if I hadn't found her what I did. I'm not killing him. Just ran out of food, like we almost did. Like we still. I might. mean, I already killed Doc, and well, okay, Doc was. All that he probably died of dehydration before he starved. Damn. What a way to live. What a way to die. I don't know. It seems very perfectly fine for me. But anyway, Kenny, you're shooting this kid. I shot your son, and I shot him because hey, he was your son. You don't need to kill quick. your own children, but you need I to learn how to kill children. I know that I can children. do it, Lee. I know you can. I know that you can. I couldn't even help my own boy. Yeah, that but was he was your, your own son. And blood. No father could have done that. But you can help this boy. Do what's right for him. Send him on his way. Yep. Lee, you're hitting all the points. You're helping Kenny recover from the death of his own son and wife by making him kill a child zombie. <laughs> yep, that's definitely part of the healing process. Just imagine it's duck, Kenny. Just imagine it's duck and then shoot it. <laughs> uh. Rest in peace, we random bury him. boy. Well, yeah, we're gonna bury him. I'll take care of it. He'll be stinky otherwise. 
Oh, we don't want to let Clem see this. We don't want to let Clem see this. Clem's just going to be like, Oh my god, what is that stinky thing? Oh. Alright. Come on, Lee. Alright. It's a slow walk. The slowest walk in the world. Gotta bury this boy. Gotta bury him. So that he can get into heaven. Or hell. Either one. Perfectly fine. Just go where you want to go. Looks different. His eyes were not closed when he died. Oh, anyway. Let's examine the boy a little bit more. Hmm. Yep, that's one dead boy and one dead dog. Anyway. Time to shovel it up. Although, how did undead rise up when there's no undead animals? You would think there would be undead animals. Alright, come on, Lee. Lee, shovel! Shovel it in! Shovel the dead body under the dirt. Shovel, just keep shoveling. While Clem watches from afar. Oh, Clem looks upset. Oh, Krista, Krista, bring Clem inside, please. Yes, thank you, Krista. Thank you for telling Clementine to go inside with your mind thoughts. Mind thoughts. Yes, real, real original. Real original thoughts there. Anyway, go on. Put that dirt in. Let's take some more. Oh my god! What the fuck? Just a creepy ass dude looking at us. Hey! Hey! Oh no, that's the guy in the radio. Stay away from us! You stay the hell away from us, you hear? Lee, what's going on? What, wait, did Ben just smile there? Someone's watching us. I saw someone standing there by the fence, watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Was it a man or a woman? Didn't get a good enough look. What it was it definitely a I'm man. I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. The guy on the radio. It's definitely a man. It was definitely a man. You could see. Just Jimmy, a creepy I'm fine. Thing. I just... I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? Lee saw someone watching us from yep. outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Yep. Me either. No shit. Walkers are one thing. But the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. Alright, that's it. We stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're What's moving it? out. We only check the house to make sure it's secure. We didn't yeah. really toss the place. We're low on food, water, yeah. meds, ammo. We should make sure there's nothing here we can use before we move out. Well, you search it if you wanna. I'm done with this house. We came to this city to find a boat, Wait, and what? that's just what I'm gonna do. Did he say his It's not this? such a bad idea to check the place one I more. said I'm done with this house. Oh, Ben, are you okay? Crystal's just like... Just look around the circle. Oh, no, he is actually really tortured. We can do both. Ben, you take one last look around the place. Grab anything that looks useful, while me and Kenny go down to the river to get us a boat. Wait, right. can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. All right, Clem. We can't right now. We can't right now. We can't right now. But you promised we'd go find them when we got here. 
On the train. You promised. I know I did, sweetie. Yeah. I haven't forgotten. But Savannah's more dangerous than I thought it would be. We all need to stick together as a group. Okay. Daylight's yeah. burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come yes. On, Clem. Sorry, Clem. See if Omid needs anything. But that guy was that was stalking us. It's the same guy on the radio. So you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Oh, Ben. Ben. That's not how it is, Ben. I need you to stay here and keep an eye on Clementine. I can do that. Well, just so we're clear, while I'm gone, anything or anyone tries to get inside this house, you shoot them. Don't even think twice about it. Understand? Yeah. I got no problem shooting walkers. Did you hear what I said? Anything or anyone? Oh, well, yeah. Yep. Good. I trusted Ben to look at Clementine. That was a huge mistake. That was a huge mistake. Why did I do that? <laughs> Yowza.